Okay, hello YouTube, ready for another video? It is freezing out in the garage, so I got my heater on, so I gotta talk a little bit loud. If you hear that blowing in the background, that is what that is. All right, so I've got a bunch of different colors. We're gonna, I didn't even count it yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So, is that right? Yeah, 15 colors. Uh, <laughs> this will be the biggest dump I've done yet. I'm gonna do just a basic pour. I wanted to get a little white on the side here and here and uh, kind of have the pour go through the middle and then swipe it and see what happens. I've never done that before, so this should be interesting. Um, uh, I've got all the colors and, and what kind they are down below. Got the coconut milk that I'm gonna try for the first time. Normally we use the uh, the silicone lubricant that a lot of people use, but I've seen people have been using this. You probably can't pick it up on the camera very well, but the description's below. And uh, I put one drop in each little mixture there, so there's a lot of uh, silicone in there and we'll see what happens. So I will go ahead and fast forward while I mix it here so you don't gotta sit here for 30 hours. And then, uh, and then uh, we'll be right back. So here we go. Okay, so we are back. Uh, so not only do I have the heater on for inside here, a little electric heater, the heater for the whole house just turned on. So it's really loud. So I do apologize about that. Um, so I've got all the colors poured into one cup here. Let's see if I can get that there so you can see it trying to turn on the light it's hard to see but there's there's all these colors and I poured them multiple times so it is just a, a massive amount of different colors going on in there all mixing together right now uh, there was one green that I think I forgot to spray a little distilled water and is a little thicker than I wanted it to be so I stopped and redid it but it's still uh all right you know what? who cares you don't care about that you just want to see the pour right yeah me too <laughs> all right so first thing first I'm gonna do the the side tie I want to do with the white here first Get a little bit of stir. This is just the white mixed with the flow trough. And like I said, description below for all the different items. So let's just get these and go something like that. Maybe right about there. Thinking that looks pretty good. Okay. And then what I'm gonna do is have the uh, the uh, all the colors go right through that middle part there. Let me just smooth this out a little bit, even though I'll be tipping it, so it's all gonna fall off, but I just wanna get a nice coverage there and make sure it's uh, kind of soaks into the mat for a second there. Having that problem lately where you do it and you move it side to side, then then all of a sudden there's just a piece of mat, or, or not mat, piece of canvas that just completely doesn't soak into or get covered. It's really weird. So, gotta make sure, just try to do a little extra here, so bear with me here for a second. That is pretty thick, but that's okay. Like I said, it's all gonna be coming off in this side. The white and the side will kind of help uh, slow down the, the moving process uh, on the other stuff. Okay, so I think that's okay. I don't think I gotta go crazy with that right now. So now I'm going to just dump it right here in the middle. Still some cool stuff up in that cup there. Uh, anyways, we got a uh, silicone mat over here that we dump our cups into and let everything dry on and we're gonna make jewelry out of it. All right, so that, is, wow, look at all those colors. Good God, that is a lot. All right, so let's start. Let's start slowly moving it. I'm gonna try to do the best I can to sort of keep that pattern in the circle as long as I can. You know, I think I said I was gonna do a swipe across here, but I don't know. I might not even swipe it. This looks pretty darn cool. So I'm trying to keep that center there as long as I can. Yeah, you know what? Let's go. Let's go a little more there. There we go. That's the thing. It, it doesn't matter. It's almost the thing I find with pouring is it's. Going in with the plan is a good idea, but don't expect it to, to work out the way you want it to. It doesn't always work out that way. I'm loving all the colors here, so I'm gonna try to get this to go off right in the corner here. Right about there. And we'll get it to go back in this corner here. Let's 
fill off. That's fill off a little bit, so it's that part over here a little bit, that way a little bit. All right. You know what? I want to come over this way just a little bit here. but I don't know, I'm just tempted to keep messing with it to see what happens. And, you know, gosh, I don't think I want to do the swipe. I think I'll take all my leftover and do a swipe on a smaller piece and see what that ends up looking like. different. I like it. I like it a lot. I think I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, gosh, I'm really sorry. That, that, uh, heater is really loud. I'm going to, uh, try to smooth it out a little bit here. So the flow, once the flow trough kicks in and smooths everything out, should be okay. But just try to help it along a little bit here. Gotta remember not to, uh, let me wipe this off first. Gotta remember, sometimes a mistake I make, I'll do it, then I'll drag it, I'll go over here, and then it drips right across the middle, so be aware of that. Don't, and, I mean, you know, and sometimes I've done an accident, and I actually like the drips, look cool, but I don't want that on this one, so. I'm gonna give a little bit of stuff on the sides here. Kinda smooth it out a little bit, just so it doesn't look like an obvious big drip. Yeah, see like over here, it's really starting to, right here, it's starting to see it show a lot of canvas right there. Let's see if I can get a little more white on there. Glad I saved just a little tiny bit here. All right, I did, I put, oh, by the way, I, I don't know if I said this earlier, but I put, um, uh, the silicone stuff, the mother's milk stuff that I've got in the description below, I put that in all the colors except for the white. I didn't want cells to form in the white. I want it to be really smooth looking, so. If you're ever doing that and you get a bunch of silicone in the white, you're gonna get cells and kind of odd bubbles there too. I mean, it, it can look really cool, but that's not what I was going for on this one, so. I think that will start to smooth out a little bit there. Yeah. Hopefully that starts to level out there a little bit. Um, so I think what I'm gonna do now is try to blow out the sides a little bit, give it a little, kind of the flared look on the sides. That might look cool. We'll do a couple of them just see how it comes out. Whoop. I'm almost wondering if I should just do it with something, you know? See what it looks like if I. Oh, geez, am I gonna start ruining this now? What if I do this? You know what? I could just cover this up with white again if I don't like the way it looks. Hmm. 
sure if I like that or not, tell you the truth. I'm not, hmm. I like this side right here, but I, eh, you know what? Let me try a different tool, actually. If I, I'm gonna try one, ah, gosh darn, I'm gonna try one hard blow here. Let's just, I'm gonna see how that develops there in a second. And I should have, I thought we had a little sharp tool over here. Where did that go? Yeah, here we go. Let's see what this does. It looks cool. I kind of thinking I like the way it looked better before I dragged it. Actually, uh, it's probably hard for you to see. I think I've got my camera focused in as far as I can get it. Oh no, I got a little bit closer for you. Let's try to get a little bit closer for you. I can see it a little better. So I don't know. These side things look. Yeah. See, I don't like the way. I... See how I, I blew it right there, and it's, it's showing all the cells. Well. If I would have just done that all the way across, that might have looked cool, but since I since I didn't do it, I'm gonna cover that up a little bit. That's cool though. I'm still liking it. It's different. That is definitely different, my friends. Now I just hope that white starts to level out a little bit more. Try to smooth out a little bit here. So give me just a second and I will take the camera <coughs> the camera off and show you a little bit closer, a closer look here. Shut off. Now you can actually probably hear me. I think it will. Yeah, this is cool. I like this. All right, let me give you a little closer look. Let me get an angle where the lights aren't reflecting on it too bad. There you go, now you can see it better. Yeah, look at all those colors though, man. Look at that. I'll, you know, let me show. I actually think it's going to be hung up this way, like this. I'm not sure actually, but let's try to 
get a good clean shot here. Dun 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 dun. Ba -na -na. Yep, I like it. Well, alrighty. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions. We'll answer the best we can. We're certainly not experts, but we're definitely learning. Having fun. Got any suggestions or tips? We'll take those too. All right, have fun. See you on the next one.